Hey guys, so in my last video, I showed you how to cut liquid tight conduit. In this video, we're going to show you how to use a liquid tight connector. So you've got multiple pieces to this liquid tight connector. And this is what provides you with a waterproof seal on your liquid tight conduit. So first things first you're going to unscrew this large this large top area which i've already done and you're going to separate the pieces so this is the bottom piece you're going to hold on to it we don't need it yet and then this top section is assembled in three pieces and it matters which order you put these in so first things first take the three pieces apart and you're going to take your you're going to take your liquid tight conduit here and you're going to slide the large cap over the seal tight just like that then you're going to slide your gasket this is a gasket this is what provides the waterproof seal right here as far as the conduit side you're going to slide it over it just like that so now you've got the large ring and the gasket now this little piece goes down inside and as you can see it's threaded so you stick that right in the end and then you screw it in now what that does is that allows you to slide these two pieces back up and this little this little gasket is going to sit underneath that lip and as you tighten this ring onto the bottom section it's going to squeeze this gasket tighter and tighter onto this seal tight or this liquid tight and provide you with a waterproof seal now to the second side what you want to do with this is you want to install it wherever you have your hole your installation hole at so i have pre-drilled a three-quarter hole right here in this sheet metal and you're just simply gonna take the lock ring off that's the lock ring so it goes it goes in here on the inside and that's what holds this connector in and then you want to make sure that you do not lose that gasket that gasket's what provides you with the waterproof seal on the exterior of this so you put this in there just like that Hang on just a second, let me get it started here so I can show you show you kind of how to do it. Hang on just a second guys. So you get that installed like that. And as you can see, the lock ring's on the inside. Now you take the other section have laying over here on the ground and it just simply seats right in there and then you screw your large ring on and as you tighten this up it all compresses together and provides a waterproof seal so you want to tighten this hand tight and then grab a pair of channel locks and torque it down until this gasket starts to squish out once that gasket starts to squish out you're done that's all you need so hopefully this helps you all out and as always make sure to like comment and subscribe for all our future videos and y'all have a great day